Welcome fellow KISS fans, welcome to It's All For You Demon, celebrating the fun of being a KISS fan. My name is Rick. I hope everyone is doing good, enjoying spring, finally being here in person. We're no longer stuck in the basement on snowy days. It's a time for joy and reflection. So I thought that is what we would do today when my friend Chuck gifted me these Scott Ian Anthrax guitar picks. Large Marge likes them. So I thought I would talk about those today and what they did for me upon seeing them. Have you ever stumbled upon something and upon stumbling upon that something, a bevy of memories opens up and you are transported back in time to your youth back to the younger days, back to days of big dreams and big aspirations and big fun and you begin to remember things you haven't thought about in years. That happened to me when I saw these guitar picks. I was suddenly back in middle school discovering Anthrax for the first time and there is a lot of Anthrax Kiss correlation and there is a lot of Anthrax Kiss correlation in my own life. So I thought today would be a good day to discuss Anthrax and KISS. Now I first discovered Anthrax back in these days, the middle school skating days. That is me and Danny. And then this was the whole crew. This was Shane, myself, my best friend Sean, best friend Dan, and Chad. And this is our street we lived on. We thought we were very cool, but looking back, just a bunch of posers. But this was the era that I first heard of Anthrax. Danny bought the I'm the Man EP on cassette, and I was hooked on those riffs. Here's a throwback for you. Dan doing Dorf on golf on his vision board. Dan was a huge vision guy. I was a... Hasoy guy at first and eventually became like a Caballero slash Paul Peralta guy. I was never good at skateboarding. I was better at BMX, but in the 80s, you go through every hobby. And then, of course, as you grow into KISS fandom, you realize the guys in Anthrax are huge KISS fans covering Parasite and eventually covering She on the Kiss My Ass record. Probably the only justifiable good song from this record is Anthrax's She. Fast forward a few years to high school, 1992. This is Dan and myself playing guitar and drums in my mom's garage for the first time ever. Extreme Close Up had a huge impact on us. We were going to be the next Simmons and Stanley. We were going to take the rock and roll world by Storm, we formed a band, two-piece band, called Dreadful Etiquette, taken from the line from Heathers, and this was our practice area in the basement. I miss that poster a lot. And this was it. We were going to be the biggest band ever. Danny played drums, I played rhythm guitar. No one sang until a year later when Anthrax released this. When Anthrax released the Black Lodge mini single in 1993, it contained a cover of Lover All I Can. I was a huge Dress to Kill fan. For some reason, Anthrax covering this song made me think Dreadful Etiquette should also cover this song. And Lover All I Can was the song that I learned how to sing and play at the same time. If it wasn't for that, a lot of my high school, college, dream, fun days would not have existed if it wasn't for Kiss or Anthrax. And that is exactly where my head went seeing these Anthrax Scott Ian guitar picks that my friend Chuck gifted to me. I went back to being that 19 year old kid 
sitting in my room, learning Lover All I Can very slowly, figuring out the riff, figuring out how to sing to the riff, and really that birthed a whole decade's worth of fun and dreams for me. Being in a band as a kid was such a good time. I haven't played since 2009. You know, dreams come, dreams go. That's cool. But if it wasn't for Anthrax's cover of Lover All I Can, there would have been a lot of fun missed in my college days. And seeing items like this and having them take you back to a certain time of youth is always a good time. Items like this that take you back in time and make you nostalgic for the past in a good way, remembering days of youth are always very cool to me. And that's half the reason I started this channel. If you are new to this channel, hit subscribe. If you are currently watching this channel and you enjoy this content, share it, like it, comment. What I really want to create here is a place, a positive place that KISS fans can come, share nostalgic memories like these on anything. Remember the days of your youth, remember having fun, share those memories, and just create a gigantic circle of good, positive, fun, KISS camaraderie. All eras of the band, all notions of the band, all fun. Just a place to share the wonderful, fun camaraderie of being a KISS fan. Thank you for hanging with me today. Take care. Be safe. Be good to your animals. I will. There's a large Marge. I will talk to you soon. You done? You done? <laughs> no, she's not. Gas man. Not me, I don't have gas. It's the actual gas man. He's outside.